All right, FitLifers, Drew Canoli. It's another exciting episode of Saturday Strategy. In this episode, I'm gonna be giving away a juicer at the end of this video. So sit tight, the winner could be you. Today, we're talking about something that's really important that we don't talk about enough, and that's being good to yourself. When was the last time that you actually were good to yourself, FitLifer? I know it's been a while. I get your emails, I've been watching you. So some things that you can do to be good to yourself may include, but not limited to, going shopping. I absolutely love shopping, who doesn't? Buying good food for yourself fueling your body with what you need. Maybe you could do a little foam rolling or get a massage. When's the last time you had a massage? Foam rolling actually opens up your muscle fascia, increasing the oxygen in your body, making you feel good, sending endorphins to your brain. One thing that I love to do is actually read. When's the last time you read a good book, FitLifer? They say every single book that you read increases your knowledge, increases your bank account, increases your well-being, and increases your overall life. I love to read. People that are affluent love reading, and that's why I do it. I, I know you wanna go from average to awesome, or maybe you're awesome already. One thing that you need to start doing, FitLifer, is reading more books. I love to read books. Or we could do a little yoga, okay? It's nice every once in a while to do some yoga. Yoga lowers your cortisol levels, thus reducing your stress, relaxing. That's what it's all about today, FitLifer. It's about relaxing, enjoying, living in the moment. You know, another thing that I absolutely love to do and I know you probably do as well. Maybe you're a little scared because you heard the sun is bad for you. You shouldn't be out in the sun, but the sun's actually really good for you. It's loaded with vitamin D. Vitamin D is an essential hormone. One thing you might want to do is do some tanning. Lay out in the sun 15, 30, 25 minutes a day is all it takes, FitLifer. And then you're going to get all the benefits from this quintessential hormone from the sun. Absolutely amazing. And then of course, you could do one of my personal favorite things, and you know already what that is. That's fueling your body with living cells, living juice. That's what this is. So why not make a summertime juice because it's absolutely beautiful here in San Diego. You can make it anywhere in the world, actually. So let's make a non-alcoholic mojito juice recipe. Shall we do that? I'm gonna need a lime. Thank you. I'm gonna need a cucumber. I'm gonna need some celery. I'm gonna need a little bit of pitcher and a water maybe, maybe that's what I need. Here we go. So one of the most important things in the mojito recipe is gonna be some good mint, straight from the farmer's market. Here it is. And then also, after we make this juice, it's very important, the most important part of the recipe actually, is to have it with some good friends. Hey, Drew. Here we are, hey guys, good to see you. Thank you. Let's have some juice. It's time to juice. Here we go. All right, so you're probably wondering who the winner of this week's Saturday strategy is. Can you pull that up on the screen real quick? Congratulations, <laughs> big round of applause. Yeah. You did amazing. We picked you because you're expressing what it means to be a fit lifer, and we appreciate you for that. So, with all of our heart, the juicer's going out to you. Stay consistent, stay transformed, and remember, we're in this together. together.